So who do we got in the chat right now? Anybody? Chard is here. Hey, Chard, did you come in through the raid from Chef? Because I didn't... I feel really bad because I didn't even... The, the, the notification didn't show up. It's really weird. The last things I see are the follows. Also, let me close that. It also doesn't show me the latest subscriber either. It's super annoying. All right, so we got the game running finally. Let me just finish this up. Oh, okay, that's awesome. That's super awesome. And the follow. <laughs> there we go. Now we got the notification. Now we got the new follower. It's just super annoying because it doesn't show me. Um, it doesn't show me total subs last latest subscribe. Oh well. He's a good guy. I think he'll he'll kind of understand it. It's not my fault. Stupid, stupid technology works so works so good, doesn't it? shouldn't have brought the food over here because I can't I can't sit here with a with a dirty dish I gotta take it out I'll be right back I promise I'll be right back and we'll definitely get into some snow runner Uh, thank you again. I can't, can't, can't ever forget, or no, can never remember that my mic is muted. Uh, I was saying thank you for the follow. I definitely have seen you in a few other channels, and it's super cool to have you here with the bear den, hanging out. <laughs> Everybody tuned in earlier, but because I wasn't playing, um, so wasn't playing Snow Runner, they probably tur turned off. Spotty connection. That's BS. It's not a spotty connection. Okay, so where did we leave off? We got a Voron AE over here. <clears throat> wow, it has not. Oh, glad to bear here. To be here. here. <laughs> um, what was I doing? What was I doing? Oh, yeah. Power station, I think, is the next, next one, or it is the one that I was going to start doing. Okay, yeah. I was like, yeah. Oh, right. I found out that this, because I have the wrong bed on it, I can't use this to actually go and do the mission that I wanted. And let's see if this has it. So I can do it with this, if it can make it over there. So let's see. I have to... Ooh, I gotta go kind of far. Dang. Dango. Um... Should I try to venture through here, maybe? Yeah, probably. Is that a Tega? Should I just... Oh, wait. Hang on. Yes, let's use the Tega. I don't want to use that other truck. <clears throat> well, look at that. That's a beautiful sight right there. So, yeah, let's just keep going northwest until I, until I get around that. Interesting music. Interesting rock music, I guess. 
Let's turn it into a chill night because, as I was saying earlier, I'm a little, little beat, a little tired, a little run down, I guess. <clears throat> and, um, well, this looks terrible. This is the way I went up, isn't it? Yeah, it's that kind of a day. Oh, yeah, you were here earlier. You, you, you were there. You agreed. <laughs> it's a snow runner with chill music kind of a day. If it is actually indeed playing. It is. It's just quiet. Well, if it plays, it plays. And if it doesn't, it doesn't. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. I didn't even do any... I was in such a rushed mood, uh, rushed afternoon that I didn't, you know, post on any... And I'm like... I didn't post on Twitter, I didn't post on Facebook, I didn't do anything. I forgot about all that. It was a busy day. Which is fine. It was busy in a good way. Like, I got to chat with a, a, a colleague and friend. But that's what, sort of, right before I got on, I was kind of talking to a friend and... And, uh, just kind of wasn't all prepared. I didn't have everything set up. But we had a had a friend playing playing Call of Duty, so and I wanted to play yesterday, but I didn't have the game in, uh, installed because I literally I do this all the time. I have like the game that I am talking about playing, and I'm like, oh, all right. And then a couple days go by, and I don't play, and then I'm like, all right, time to delete the game and install something else, right? Silly. Oh, okay, so go to the right-ish. They were low on fuel also. Is there fuel right behind me, I think? <clears throat> it's funny that the truck volume is mysteriously quiet again. So, Chard, how are things going for you? Welcome to the stream. This is me. I am the Bear Den. No, wait. I am Nate the Bear Gurger. <laughs> Alright, we'll, yeah, we'll take some of its fuel. It'd be cool if there was a repair here, too, but it doesn't look like it. <clears throat> we sometimes... We, I finally got the Xbox to be able to stream, so that's, that's kind of exciting. Also, your follow puts me at 199 followers, which makes awesome sense and is perfect for the challenge last weekend it was like okay we're definitely going to hit 200 followers so the new challenge and the giveaway contest is whoever clips the most and the and has like the most you know kind of it'll be judged on quality and quantity you know you first get into the the running by just clipping a bunch and then the person with the most clips <coughs> with with quality in mind um you know it just can't just be me sitting there picking my nose like it actually has to be something cool um the person with the the viewer with the most clips after 30 days and we may extend the uh the timeline if we don't get entries um gets uh, there's gonna be a three we're gonna pick three winners top three and i think because it's going to steam i might it might be like uh, it might it might be so, snow runner. <laughs> oh great, Chard, you got one. <laughs> Swear all you want. It's an eighteen plus stream. <laughs> it's very different than my normal streams. <laughs> That's awesome. Let's see, you got one. We got a few people that are at one, <laughs> but that is a good one. A good one. It almost seems like the volume, the game volume, is just like straight turned down or off. Oh, it is turned. Oh, right, because I was playing Trackmania. That's why Trackmania's volume was crazy high and had no way to adjust it. So, Char, do you play any of this game? Any Snowrunner? You're probably like, oh, I better start playing. Look at this game. 
You hadn't heard of it. No word, no kidding. No, I, I believe it. I mean, this this is a uh, this is an off-road simulating game, truck simulator with a lot of off-road components. So, unless you uh, well, and it's not like a big AAA blockbuster type game. But look at this. Look at this mud. The mud terrain and the snow. That's the main thing. It's called Snow Runner. Hey, there's the snow. So anyway, yeah, the main thing in this is to, oh right, I need two metal beams, so it'll either be two trips, or I find a trailer on the way. Did I just leave the trailer station? No, okay, good. Is there a trailer station over here? No. There's a trailer store way over there, and there's fuel, so I guess that's sort of maybe what we do, unless this is a trailer that I can use, fuel carrier, no. There is some kind of trailer over there, what is that? That's another fuel? Yeah, fuel. Yeah, so, okay, so let's go on a scout flatbed. Interesting. Well, either way, yeah, we'll go to the trailer station, the trailer store, and then try to get up to that through these side roads. And we're not using GPS. It is. It's a very, it's a very chilled game. I mean, it definitely has its frustrating points, but, like, that's the beauty of its, that's the beauty of its uh, difficulty level, I think. Is that it really? Oh, that's nice. Look at those rocks. Hmm. <clears throat> um, distraction. Um, yeah, it's got its frustrating points, but it, it is mostly just about driving <laughs> and uh, and not rolling over. And and there's a um, no. Plus the bet. Look at the sky. Look at the sky box here. Oh just amazing yeah so we want to drive around and make sure we accept all of these oh look at this thing is so broken this is so beat more fuel though that's good and yeah most of the most of the game is mud um, this game started there was a, the original game was spin tires and that, seriously, I don't know if that would have damaged that much, but okay. Um, Spin Tires was the original one. It was more like a tech demo in a way. Like, it just basically was a tiny little map or two maps or something. Demoed the mud physics, and then that was it. Um, had a couple trucks. Then Mud Runner came through and added more trucks, more stuff. Uh, and then Snow Runner, obviously, last year came out and and added way more. It's got all of what the other games had, but instead of just moving logs and wood, you're moving, you're building things and br building bridges and bringing, oh, it's just, it's, it is nice. Um, doing a lot of construction work and then they, and then later on, um, they added, um, I know I'm stuck, I'm stuck pretty bad. Later on, they added uh, log missions, like the original. Yeah, so I should go around this. And you can winch. They got the winch ability, just like in real life. It will save so many things. It's no, it's a four-player co-op. Um, there is no cross-platform right now, though. And and I usually sometimes do. Uh, I sometimes play with viewers on Fridays, depending on what game and whatnot. Uh oh, what's going on? Oh, the game kind of lagged a little bit. I think it's it's even it's the game is so much even better in co-op because instead of you being the only one driving trucks, obviously you have your friend, and sometimes your friend is like, "Oh, I'm, I'm part way down with part way through this mission, but I can switch to another truck and help you, and then jump back to the original truck and the original mission." That's a great game, and and each so you each get to bring your own playthrough into whatever co-op you're playing. So you whatever. You know, all your good trucks you can bring into your, your friend's stream, which is really good. And then help him. And you earn the XP and the money from any mission you complete, even on other people's co-op. Um, but you don't, it won't count as completed, completing the mission on yours so that you can get double. You go get double the XP. That's a pretty good system. 
And I've got this Tega kind of kitted out to be very fast. So it's got eight gear. It's got an eight gear transmission. Yeah, T A uh, T A Y G A, Tega, the Tega. Unlike the Taiga, which is a sort of area in north uh, northern Russia. There you go, Taiga. <laughs> yeah. And I don't. If it, some of, they're all like based on real trucks, but they're all kind of like how GTA does it. Like they're they're similar, but. Um, similar but not the same name to avoid copywriting but I think there are there are a bunch of trucks that are exact for some reason PC got the, the licenses for that and and yeah Taiga I read about it there's a great documentary with Werner Erzog as the uh, as the uh, as the director um, called Happy People a Year in the, Ta in the Taiga <laughs> and it's just so fantastic especially if you like outdoorsy stuff I mean, these are people that have literally lived off the lands um, since the people existed and still do. And I gotta ask Chard Veg, how did you come about that name? Um, because I love it. A. And so this is the garage that I'm trying to unlock. So this game becomes so hard when you can't recover and or have a garage nearby um but yeah i had to ask like how did you get the name chard because i love it because i was just i've sort of been switching and it, this may be irrelevant to the name but i've been sort of moving towards less meat uh, less of less primarily a meat diet not not because of diets or fads or blah 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 but truly because i naturally don't eat a lot of meat i don't uh and i don't really like it <laughs> i like chicken i'll eat chicken all day and hamburger like if it's ground up and whatnot that's easier for me to eat but uh and so anyway i just experimented with the uh beyond meat uh sausages which were so good i was like this is this is this this is meat. I like, guess is as good as that. This is no different. But anyway, so how did you come up with the name? <clears throat> as I blab on. <laughs> See, so worked at a co-op for a while. I was into the gardening stuff, and you're a vegetarian. And my name was Richard. And eventually, I realized I might be non-binary. And charred just suddenly made sense. That's super cool. I dig that. That's a really cool. Like I wasn't actually expecting that like it deep of a kind of answer. I, I, but I guess it doesn't exactly surprise me because I was like, chard, I know is a very specific vegetable that you would have to kind of know it existed to to put it as a as a name. So so we just got we just got high centered pretty bad. The rocks in this are terrible. So we got a winch out of here. Um, oh yeah, and that's the last part of, of the name Richard is charred. Yeah, I, I didn't put that part of it together. <laughs> Cora. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Or like quinoa, if that's even how you're supposed to pronounce it. I mean, that's more popular now. Panera Bread's got a quinoa bowl or whatever. Um, and then, and then you said, and you said you're getting organic, organic, and you're and you're vegetarian. So yeah, yeah, that's super cool. Quinoa Phoenix. <laughs> that's so funny. Like the opposite of it sort of. It really is the same name. Like you, you're using all the same letters for quinoa, uh, almost except for the J. What is so the the Voron was much better at this. No, I don't want to winch there. That's not where I want to winch. I winch there. Quinoa Phoenix. <clears throat> yeah, I super respect the vegetarian choice. 
Um, I think it's, I think it's where where the world is sort of moving towards anyway, um, because of so many reasons. And and I'm like, dude, I'm I don't have a problem with that. Like, if you tell me that eating eating this Beyond Meat sausage is gonna help save the planet, are you are you telling me that eating is gonna help save the planet? You got me. You got me instantly. Let's see. This time, the burger. I had some ground meat. That was, but yeah, I had the. Oh my god, beyond. I had this amazing burger at a restaurant, and I and I was like, you know, I was at this restaurant, and I was like, and they had a ton of vegan stuff, and I was like, you know, I normally at a restaurant, I'm like, oh, what's something like cool I can get that I don't make at home. You know, etc., cetera, etc., cetera. and and I see all this vegan, all these vegan options, and I'm like, you know, I'm not gonna make, I, I can't make, I can't make vegan stuff that easy at home. Let's give this stuff a try. Like, I'm not gonna sit there and do the experimentation and figure out what actually tastes good. <laughs> and this place seemed pretty popular, so I was figuring, you know, they'll they'll have the the they'll have it down pat. And so yeah, I had this amazing. Uh, vegan nachos that tasted cheesy like I was like yeah you got me that sounds that tasted that tasted cheesy so and oh it was filling it was like wow and then I had this amazing beyond yeah the uh, beyond burgers it was so good I remember sitting back and going yeah no that you, you, you sure that's not real <laughs> yeah I think it worked because of um, and, and the cheese on the burger was good too like that's the other thing that blew my mind was like like you you got me the burger itself whatever it was chickpea and it's a, and you know soy or whatever you know was good enough but you, now you, you got this cheese on here that actually is like yeah actually tastes it didn't like taste you know the thing is it didn't exactly taste like cheese but you know it was uh I mean, it did kind of, it tasted like cheese and and had like that kind of creamy kind of whatever, whatever kind of texture flavor you're going for. No, I don't think it was Daya. I think I've had Daya before or I've seen it and I'm like, yeah, I definitely have had it because I was like, this is, <laughs> stop kidding yourself. Nobody's eating this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, I bet. Yeah. This was, this was really good. Whoa. Whoa. This was really good. I kind of want to go back there this weekend. But yeah, um, yeah, I had to ask charred veg. That that really that makes sense. It all it all adds up. I bet I bet that it was that. I bet it was because you know what? It kind of had a dark. It was kind of a dark brown color. The cheese wasn't like. So I bet it was an almond. I bet I bet you're right. Bet your bottom dollar right there. Okay, so now we can get a sideboard bed. And then we'll take all the metal beams. Oh, actually, you know what? Let's, um, let's get a... Is there fuel nearby? There's fuel not really exactly nearby. Uh, actually, is that fuel... Does that have fuel in it? It does not have fuel in it. Let's back up. Back it up. Okay, so now I'm going to detach. I'm going to drive... Oh, drive forward. <laughs> and then I'm going to get a fuel carrier refuel and I might as well fill this scout trailer up as well <laughs> put that in the back <laughs> this game is kind of dumb because you can buy the trailer and then take the fuel and then sell it back without any loss of money but that's because this is easy mode hardcore mode is being released on may 18th um all right oh i don't have a crane so otherwise i would put that scout trailer on here all right so now we've got to go out to the right and then take the next left or actually we could go left and then right 
Trucks can have cranes too. Uh, I think I think this guy has my crane right now. Oh yeah, it's hard to see. They're attachments, so if your truck has enough room, it can have multiple attachments. Hard to see. Yeah, it is very hard to see. And then at night. Yeah, there's a whole lot of, and this is just, this is one of the DLC maps too. Here, Char, let me show you. So there's, so the first three, Michigan, Alaska, and Tymere, those are the base, that's the base game. <laughs> and then they gave us three DLCs, and then we're getting a whole other map. Um, and yeah, so this is, yeah, it's, ugh, it's so much. And, and so, yeah, anyway. Um, yeah. Yeah. Like I've I've always loved off roading. Uh, I grew up driving jeep jeeps around and trying to build them and helping my brother build them. So this this kind of was like right up my alley. And actually, you know what? Let's go let's go left. Let's go let's go the interesting way. Chards here. We might as well make it interesting. Here we go. <laughs> and actually, you know what? Let's, uh, it is beautiful, but let's, uh, brighten this up a little bit. This <laughs> would never have seemed off road to me. <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking that was sarcasm. Am I going up? Am I trying to go up the wrong one? What's going on here? What the heck? When I said make it interesting, I didn't mean just get stuck everywhere. What? Is it because I don't have enough clearance? Or is that not the right one? Do I need to go on that one? Alright, I did this. And then let's actually use this. Yeah, okay. Not enough room. <laughs> Alright, so it's a trial and error kind of game. What about on this side? Can I get up here? Ooh, that's not looking good. That is not good. That's very deep. Well, I did not expect it to get, like, kind of this interesting. Oh, so you know what I've got? Uh, I've got a... You see this little thing on the left? That is a snorkel. So, luckily, the uh, air intake isn't there. You're you're 100 right. You're 100 right. It's 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 you're exactly right. If I didn't have the uh, the uh, precautions, and I don't even think I'm. Let's see if we can. Okay, let's do this again. All right. Well, okay. Maybe we won't go this way. Maybe there's a reason. I think it's because I have. So you can get damage in the game. It's not all arcade. Oh yeah, and and so now the other thing is I've damaged this vehicle in in a in a playthrough before, and so it's got some flat tires. It's got it's got one flat tire. I'm guessing that's the front tire, which is making it so it, it can't go anywhere pretty much. And what is going on now? Am I just am I just lollygagging? All right, we're moving slowly. Very very slowly. Come on, let's go. Bring my truck back. There we go. Let's see which tire is flat. <laughs> Doesn't do any long-term damage. I've, I have, I think I have used Fix-A-Flat before. 
in real life, but not in this game. But yeah, it does not look like I'm going to be getting down here. All right, well, we tried. Um, let's winch that backwards. Unless I need to approach from a different angle. I guess, I guess I could just get around it. <laughs> There's no tube left. It's just fix a flat. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, hey. Yeah, I'm lucky to... I've got some decent tires on my, on my vehicle. In, in the game and in real life. And I guess, yeah, but flat tires, man. I, we have, we've had, uh, when we were off-roading, there's been times where uh, the wheels have just fallen off while just driving on normal dirt roads, though. Not on the off-road yet. Oh, my God. Wow, we're getting hung up left and right. Maybe the Voron is really the ideal truck for this environment. Let's try to go between the trees. So look away. These are fake trees. They're not dead. They're just sleeping. They laid down. They were like, oh, he's coming. Lay down. Uh, all right, so I think I'm going up and around. I'm going to try to... I almost want to stay off way off to the left. Uh, like way up and go up that way. But I will... I'm going to stay to the left here. So the other... Yeah, the strategy sometimes of the game is avoiding the mud if you can. And going in it if you have to. Because you're, it's just going to slow you down so much. And if you can get around it, you go way faster. So we're going to try to get up to that yellow square up there, that yellow arrow. We'll go high gear. We'll get some speed here and turn left. Oh, we got some of the deep snow. So, okay, so here's the new terrain for Amandra includes deep snow, which you'll see sort of have, has like a sort of a dark you can see some of the the ruts over there sort of have a darker spot that's yeah the deeper snow the deadly deeper snow and i'm kind of thinking the take is going to be not <laughs> murders trees for fun and profit that's a good clip <laughs> um i'm kind of thinking the take is not gonna not gonna cut the mustard on this one i think i might I might do something crazy and drive the Voron all the way back. Because if it's getting this hung up already, eh, this isn't going to be good. Do we have any rescue trucks nearby? That one's there. This one's over here. And that one's there. Freightliner's way over here. And I'm going to take out way over here. Hmm. I am inching backwards ever so slightly, I think. Yeah, we are inching backwards. But yeah, we're going to run out of fuel before anything else. Okay, so that's some deep snow. Yeah, let's go let's go change over the Voron. Like this this got this has got to be the truck. It already looks bigger. Got to break out the shovels, yeah. Literally. All right. So now this sucks though. Oh, I really don't want to have to do this. <laughs> let's just see if we can get the Freightliner over. The Azov's there. See, the Azov's got mud tires. <laughs> what is this thing? Like a cargo container on wheels? What, this car? This The one that I'm in right now? <laughs> Alright, let's so northwest. We're heading. God, this is going to be a pain. Oh, the last one? Which one? Was that uh, this guy? Or did I go to this one real quick? <laughs> this one's really good. This is my uh, my maintenance rescue truck. 
Yeah. Yeah. This is the maintenance truck. So that, that thing on the back has... Uh, uh, it's got like a 1,400 liters of fuel and 300 repair. Ends up being pretty useful. Okay, so let's go left. Go over the sketchy, sketchy, sketchy parts. Well, this truck is the Freightliner. I don't have chain tires on it, so I probably will flip or roll or any other number of horrible things that can happen in this game. I think the other cool, cool thing about this game, you know, the good thing is that it's it's not a lot of pressure besides when you're driving, you know, by yourself or whatever. Like in, you know, obviously in Call of Duty, there's a lot of pressure and, comp and competition, etc. And like, there's no, there's no thing that's chasing you in this game. This is purely just you driving, trying to get things done. That's it. But the Freightliner is really good. I wouldn't be surprised if it goes through this snow very easily. And like, so here's another key. Like, no, don't bother going. Don't even worry about going over those rocks. Like, why? Go around them. Makes life a little easier. <laughs> Gardening, not just not literal. Yeah, every time for me beats the reaction time. Yeah, reaction time. Yeah, that's a good way to describe it. Because Call of Duty is literally talking about how. Especially in hardcore, it's like whoever see you, whoever sees the if you see your enemy first, whoever whoever spotted first, it's going to be the one that wins most of the time. And I don't, I don't like that. I like it being stri strategy. I mean, I like that in a sense, but it definitely can be very frustrating to just kid, die and die and die and die and die. Or, like, you do what I did and move very slowly and only die four times, but, or 17 times, but still, like, I don't want to die. My guy is a hero. Heroes don't die. What? It's nonsense. And there's no, I really wish they would give us the ability to clear these rocks, but maybe that'll come in phase four. Or just become a zombie. <laughs> There's no third way. Yeah, I mean, in a zombie apocalypse, I actually think I would be one to uh, definitely fight them, try to fight them off. In, but that's, I guess that's the part of me that would be like, would want to be strategical and I'm not saying I'd be able to outrun them. <laughs> I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna rely on on uh, endurance. Although in a zombie apocalypse, I probably wouldn't be eating as great, and I'd be active but way more, so... Gotta make traps. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, I feel like it's all of it, you know? That's the, like... I remember, so... Alright, so my friends and I... we My brother's friends and I, we used to just, you know, sit around and kind of think about how we would survive a zombie apocalypse. And the thing I realized is that everybody's gonna have a talent that's gonna add to the community survival. And so, like... You know, my brother was really into tech, and he would have all these, like, elaborate um, traps and communications and all kinds of things. And so, like, then another guy would be, you know, mainly, like, actually re uh, re not reforging, but, um, what's it called? So, recasing, recasing ammunition, um, and, like, and, like, forging, and, like, blacksmithing, and, and all kinds of things, and be good at that. I think we had another guy who would basically be <laughs> in charge of food. <laughs> but yeah, it, we didn't have a guy, you know, it wasn't like set up, but it was like that's who, everybody would have their different roles and that'd be the way that, the way for survival. You need people to be security, you need people to do non-security stuff. Except Wayne. That guy eats the rations. <laughs> Freaking Wayne. Wait, is Wayne, is that an actual reference to... Um, what game was that? Was that a? Is that that's not a reference to, uh, to uh, Dead Rising, is it? Because I remember there being a guy who was like eating rations, eating food or something. I think we had to decide. I remember being a nice guy and letting him join us, and then he ate, and then he ate all of our food. <laughs> not intentionally. 
I don't think his name was Wayne, though. I forget. Let's see if we can make it over this. That's real life, though. <laughs> it's funny. Now, can it... Wow, this is a beast of a truck. I gotta give it to Falcon. He's another regular viewer of my, of, in the in this in the SnowRunner community. Okay, so I want to go up and to the left. Oh, actually, no, that's a long. No, I'm gonna go the other way. I'm gonna turn around, actually. Or not turn around, but go left. Did it? <laughs> I didn't even notice. I was too focused on. Ooh, this will be interesting. Good thing it's got those rock sliders. Oh, is it going to get high center? No, this truck's too beastly. So, so also the game can really demonstrate what it's like to have lock, lock, <coughs> locking differentials. I don't know if you know what locking differentials are. But it, it also demonstrates all the differences between all-wheel drive and having and rear-wheel drive. As you can see... The right tires are spinning. You can also see that the right tires are spinning a lot. Like that back tire is spinning like crazy. The front one isn't. Again, spinning. So we'll put all the drive on. Now all of the wheels can spin, but they're not. Put the diffs on, and now everything's locked. And so it just basically, diff locks just mean that all of your tires, your axles, everything spins at the same speed rather than different. Um, and you want... You want them to spin at different speeds while driving normally because uh, for fuel efficiency and comfort on the road, I think. That's a silly question. No such thing as silly questions unless it's like, how many hats do you wear uh, when you are in the bathtub? <laughs> I don't know. Actually, I guess the question would be, how many silly hats do you wear? Feel free. All questions are approved. And we are going the long way. We don't actually have to bring this trailer. I just figured it would help. It's much extra work. Does it make sense fuel efficiency to rig up winches and rely on those for tough climbs instead of grinding through snow sometimes? Hmm. I, and I definitely don't think it's a silly question. I think it's a very thoughtful question. Would it make sense fuel efficiency? So, it would. It sort of depends. In and I assume maybe we're talking about in the game and not in real life. But I can kind of, I can speculate on both answers. Um, in the game, some some of the winches have to have the yeah. So in the game, some of the winches have to or the trucks have to be on for the winches to work. But there's scout. Oh, look at this. This is crazy. There's scout trucks that can have an autonomous winch, and then that's battery powered. So then that leads into the the thought about in real life. So in real life, um, you 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 would have to have a you'd have to have a separate battery. And it would have to be a really beastly one, and you would drain it, <laughs> I think. I think you would drain it very quickly, or at least too quick. So in some ways, oh, that's interesting too, because now I'm thinking about, what about with the electric cars? What's that going to do? Because those have a big battery. They don't drain that fast, but I feel like it would drain one of those batteries very quick. There's probably some electro electric, electrical engineering stuff that I'm not thinking about, or can't even think about because i don't know that <laughs> but that is a good question and and so you know i think it's true and in the game coming back to the game um it the fuel efficiency so if we left it in rear wheel drive and then winch the rest of the way i think it really it's the thing is it might take longer still Because then, you know, there's times when you won't need... Because I think you might... Ooh. 
Yeah, especially if you were so sort of like you had the engine off and in neutral. Yeah, because I think in real real life, definitely winches don't go fast. Not that I think I've seen them go very slowly. Um, they're a constant pull. That's the beauty of them. And then in this game, I think. I think it would be. I think it's more fuel efficient to just put it in low gear and like figure out how to have the most traction and winch when you need to, or when definitely when when you need to. Um, and yeah, I think it would use more fuel. Oh, here we go. We're hung up now. Ooh, that's a long winch cable. Yeah, ask away. And you'll have to stop calling them silly at some point. Unless they become silly. Like, like, like how many potatoes does it take to get to Mars? Because that's, that's just not how potatoes work. That's how, that's silly. <laughs> oh, that's, I appreciate that comment. Um, I hope, I hope so. I hope not only is there abundant knowledge wrapped up in this. But it also can be put up, you know, like um, explained in a way that people understand. But okay, so got your wheels on the underside of the car or truck. Yes, like, like, yeah, they are. Like, we can't see them from the aerial view because they're up there. Oh, okay, so should I take that left? No, 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 no. Straighten around. We got some quiet vibes going today. Just a chill, chill day. Hmm, Weevil Spring. Is that kind of like Weevil's Wobbles but they don't fall down? Unstick Vehicles. So as, as as I was thinking about what a, what a spring would be, I was thinking about um, the tow, um, not tow line, uh, a recovery strap. So they're designed to transfer um, triangular piston. That sounds similar. Are you thinking of a, well, the, the thing I was thinking of, I wonder if it's, so two trucks tied together, they've got um, a strong but somewhat elastic uh, rope in between them and, and the kinetic energy is like transferred as one truck pulls forward it pulls the string but it, it gently pulls the truck forward I guess it's not kinetic I guess it is kinetic but it um, I don't know if that's what you're thinking a weevil spring is I wonder if that's similar I have to look that up so if Puma was on which he might jump on soon I don't know he hasn't messaged me yet um, he's a real engineering whiz and, and he'd be able to probably answer that question better than me. <laughs> not that I'm not, I'm always willing to take a stab at an answer. But yeah, this is probably one of the chillest games I've ever played and we're probably one of the most, you know, outside of, I keep thinking about this game and I think of Halo being some of the best games I've ever played. That's a, we're saying a lot. Super Mario 64, I think this game is up there with all of them. Like, it's, it's for me especially, because but it's got that challenge, that sense of exploration. It's got everything. Oh, oh okay, okay. Weevil as in the uh, bug. I should have, yeah, I see. Um... Oh, that's interesting. Grasshopper legs are something that like that only come down if you belly out and need to lift out. I have, I think I've seen or heard about something. I if if Aaron the Puma, if my brother gets on, he I'm sure he's probably heard of it. Yeah, I know what you mean. Like almost like a some jack stands look kind of that way, triangular. Hmm. So I'm not sure. There there might be. Um, I wonder, there's also, um, 
like high lift jacks that look kind of i mean they don't exactly look like what you're describing but they're a very you know like a five foot solid metal piece of you know piece of metal with rungs and holes in it and then with this kind of clippy kind of long thing that kind of it's really strange i don't even know how to describe it All right, we can go faster now. We're just on the ice, so it's very dangerous. So sometimes, sometimes I'm here as Nate the bear. Sometimes I'm here as Yanni the bear because I because I'm yawning. Yanni. Yanni. <laughs> yeah, no, definitely. So there's uh, uh even in the car you might have, might have a scissor jack. Um, that concept, yeah, definitely. I was thinking about it as soon as you said um, triangular. I, see, I was starting to think of jacks. Yeah, a jack with like a screw in the center. Really amazing physics stuff um, but yeah Aaron the Puma gets kind of really into the details of it and I uh, I glaze over I'm more of a I'm more of into uh, writing and socializing and communication That's, those are my strengths so if I was in so me in the zombie apocalypse I would try to help communicate with the zombies now <laughs> I would help I would be like helping like make peace with the other um, what would we say the other refugees maybe we would call them the other camps other people trying to uh, just make it, you know, survive. Oops, let's put this on. Yeah, and, and we would definitely... So it's funny that you say that because um, when two years ago i think maybe two and a half or three years ago um my brother and i started playing online because we discovered sea of thieves was co-op and he was he was one to be pretty diplomatic when we saw like other players and i was always like no we have to attack them we're pirates like that's what we're that's what we're here to do and one of the times i was like all right let's be diplomatic i finally decided okay we can be diplomatic this time, and we'll just try to chit chat with them and make conversation. And but I was like, I was like, that's fine. But on the on the off chance that they're going to betray me or betray us, I'm not saying anything. I'm just going to watch them, make sure they don't do anything sketchy, and I'm going to give them a warning too. Let them know, like you can come on our ship, but Nate the Bear over there, Sergeant in Arms, <laughs> and. Uh, and I don't think they did anything. I think they were chill. They were cool. But I was like, dude, I don't... This is a video game. It's So this isn't even real life. Like, there's no moral consequence for betraying somebody in a video game. Unless you, like, swear that you're not going to betray each other. But, like, even then, it's like... Nobody, nobody... Nobody's gonna... I mean, I think I would. But even then, I'd be like, yeah, of course I'm going to betray them at some point. It's a pirate game. It's all part of the code. All right, let's, uh, I'm going to switch it back to more, uh, yeah, we'll go with morning. It's not too, not too dark. <laughs> Even you got to be practical at some point. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, it definitely, it's, yeah, it makes sense. Survival works if many people kind of, uh, I don't know, contribute. We're getting kind of hung up here. Just get a nice, good spot there. Yeah, these rocks. Brutal. This truck does amazingly well, though. It's 
especially with these tires. And we're not doing so good with fuel, so hopefully I can make it to... Hopefully I can make it to the uh, spot I need to. Alright. <laughs> okay, yeah, what do you got? What do you got? I like things that get the mind going. And especially if it's controversial, I, I, I welcome those. We just we just don't really do a lot of alcohol or drug talk here. Um, we don't do we don't talk. We're not racist. We're not prejudiced. Things like that. We respect each other. We have some fun. Howler, welcome. What's up, Howler? How's it going? You're here to see me. Yeah, this is not COD. I did. I refreshed it on my end. Oh yeah, it still thinks I'm doing COD. Yep, good call. Thank you. Uh, I thought I, I didn't. I did everything except that part. Thank you. <laughs> um. Yeah, yeah. We were just talking about what's what's allowed here. And uh, Heller, welcome Chard into the uh, into the chat. Chard is new to the stream. Came in through our friend that's Atticus. Which oh, I should have said earlier, chat Chard, if you want. There's a command for Atticus, and it's exclamation point Addy, A-T-T-I. Oh, good. We made it to the vehicles. Hmm. Like basically, with no huge changes, just ch timing the motor to pulse in a kind of rhythm instead of a steady state output. Apparently, that single charge can yield great efficiency improvement. That's just kind of my own thing. Interesting, interesting. Very interesting. So first let's uh, pull this guy out. It's uh, interesting. There we go. Okay. I thought, it was, I thought it was stuck at first. That's interesting. It is kind of stuck. Oh, not really. Never mind. Here we go. So it's a more... It pulses a kind of rhythm instead of a steady state output. Apparently that single chain... Oh, that's... I saw... I read it as charge, so I'm glad I reread that. It pulses. Interesting. Huh. I don't even... I wonder what that entails interesting like like it uh, there's got to be some like capacitor or something that holds the charge or but interesting it pulses some and then stops instead of just constantly yeah that kind of makes sense um we're not going to refuel it it's got plenty of fuel anyway but we are going to repair as much as we can yeah gas tank let's get a wheel fixed all of it. There we go. And let's stop this engine. Switch back. Yeah, if you find the news article, um, whisper it to Howler. Howler, if you don't mind, I'm volunteering you. And feel free to say no. Whisper it to Howler so that uh, it can be posted in the chat. Because we have ch we have links disabled. This is not a this is a, not a link friendly zone. All right, so did I just need to turn sharper, or is this really going to bog everything down? I think I need to just turn sharper. So, Howler, how's your how's your day going, man? Appreciate you swinging by. How are things going? I'm guessing you're here to see me suffer some more. I almost decided to drive the Voron all the way back to the Lake Coved garage because it. I wanted to use that for this mission but we're going to try to do this mission with uh the tega and this met in this cart i don't know if it's going to actually work though i may have to go get a scout vehicle to come back oh dude baseball with your son that's so cool or baseball game for him that's so cool what uh what position does he play 
Is it, and is there what, what level is it like little league t-ball big big t-ball oh gotcha yeah no worries I also would wouldn't necessarily expect you to uh, I mean I would certainly appreciate it but yeah if you're at your kids kids thing yeah, 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 yeah do that Man, look at the snow here this is new I haven't really exactly seen this they definitely changed the snow physic. That's so cool. <laughs> I mean, not changed it, but they for a, for this part of the level, it's a little different than I've seen it. Look at how slowly we're making it through here. This is going to be all winching, I'm guessing. Okay. Fifth grade tourney league. Cool. Fifth grade... Fifth grade, man, he's eleven. Young, young kid. That's so cool, though. Was it cold out, or is it uh, Colorado, right area, or was that Apollo? <laughs> you guys have names that are so <laughs> color was so similar. Now it stands out. <laughs> Can we do high gear? No, we can't do high gear. West, jeez, oh, I can't remember any of these things. That's okay. Wisconsin, right? I remember because I'd say I gotta go Wisconsin, and you'd be like, "Oh, I'll give you an idea what it's like." And then I remember talking about cheese, and you were like, "Yeah, it's good cheese," but mm, I'm in an area that has good cheese as well. <laughs> Ooh, that's a beautiful shot right there. That's the Tega just. Enjoying taking a little sip of some snow right there. Just doesn't make any sense. It's not even here. Then, then that also means that um, Apollo definitely is the Colorado guy. Or no, Tufts, Colorado. I think Tufts, Colorado. Oh, zero to ten, so it wasn't that fun. But I think they learned a lot. Hopefully, yeah. Yeah, you don't know you don't win every game, and hopefully, you know, and it's not always about winning. It's hard. A lot of pressure in those kinds of games too. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, you know the pitcher is so key in baseball. That's not me saying it. I remember people who actually know things about baseball saying that. It also makes sense. You know, they he is. They, I shouldn't say he, but they are the ones that. Um, yeah, they're throwing the ball right at the guy who could score, you know, who could get a home run. Ooh, look at that. That was dicey. Let's go first gear. We don't need second gear with this. All right, let's go low gear. Yeah, we'll move a little faster with the low gear on. That's probably why nobody was jumping in. <laughs> Thought I was still playing Call of Duty. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to have enough fuel to get up there and back. So I probably should think about a, a fuel truck getting up here. A S A S P S A. The Tega King. Look at that, beautiful. <laughs> Come on now, we don't... Sorry, tree.
I wonder what size tires these are, because I don't I think they're as big as the I think the Voron just has a, a higher suspension. Maybe. Maybe not. Alright, we made it up the hill. That wasn't so bad. And now I've got to drive in there. That's kind of a bummer. Can I... This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to drag the trailer in. Make my life easier. Oh, I didn't want to roll it over. Oh boy, what's happening there? Oh, things are going to space. <laughs> There's a contest over here, too. And we don't care about contests. Oh, I thought I couldn't get... Thought I couldn't get too many. <laughs> oh, I'm glad. I appreciate you trying to trying to find it and look for it. A lot of these things. What's important is which companies end up using the patents and technologies anyway. Mm. And uh, and if they actually start using them, that's the other important thing. So should we go through here? Ooh. Oh, that doesn't really look like a path. Oh, I see. There's the path. Yeah, that doesn't seem too wise. Hmm. Do we try to cross? This looks like a road. That is a road. There's telephone wires. Alright, let's go up there. So to the right, to the right. And okay, so we'll just follow the road and we'll go through that valley, I guess. Although it looks kind of like people have driven down this way. That looks too hard though. So often I ask what people have uh, have had for dinner. <laughs> I already had dinner. Usually I ask because I'm getting ready to make dinner and I'm curious about what people have had. But I am curious what people ate. Chad, we were talking about vegetarian options and I, I love those uh, Amy's Organic Frozen Microwavable Meals. Whether they're healthy or not, I don't care. Um, they say they don't have dairy and uh, the, the vegetarian part is one thing, but... So I have somewhat of a lactose intolerance, and so dairy-free things are idea, ideal. Uh, so I had I had the tofu scramble. Oh, it's so good. And when I go to Chinese restaurants or Asian restaurants, I um, I usually ask for tofu because I'm kind of tired and sick of meat from Chinese places because it's either it's always rubbery first, or unless you get it in the, the 007 fingers, the uh, chicken fingers but they're always rubbery it's like chicken and meat is not supposed to be rubber stop steaming your vet your meat it's an interesting statement hmm I I 100% know that feel. Um, know that that that's what you got to do. The budget, eating on a budget is not super fun. I know. I'm lucky. I'm lucky to be in the place that I am and doing what I do. Hmm. Yippee! Yippee! Kaye. 
that appears to be oh that's the watchtower and I already got that right yeah wait where is the watchtower Oh, 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 I was looking the wrong way. Yeah, yeah, we don't have to go there. Wait, what? Oh, okay, I see. <laughs> there is a little path there. I don't know what that is. Maybe there's an upgrade down there. No, I would have found it, I think. Maybe not. There might be an upgrade there. I know what you mean, though. And by eating good, f yeah. LW, welcome, welcome. We are just talking about food and what everybody's had for dinner. LW, what did you have for dinner? If you had dinner already. We're dragging metal beams down to the substation. We had a grilled cheese. Yummy. Yummy. Welcome back. Um, yeah, I like a grilled cheese. It'd have to be with cabot cheddar. Oh, no. <laughs> I save it all? No way! But not all of it. Okay, okay. Hang on. Hang on, everybody. Hang on. Boom. Let's go backwards. No, 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 no. So, yeah. Oh, I'm, cu I'm curious. Um, Howler, what do you think of Cabot Cheddar Cheese? Or Cabot cheese in general. Is it good cheese? Since you're a Wisconsinite. How about we try... Mm, no, that's not what I want. I want it to go straight back. Oh, she tipping. Low, she tipping. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Alright, let's try. I, I wish I had a central pole, like a pole right in here. Um, a winch point down there, but I guess not. <laughs> Chart is Minnesota. Minnesota. Uh, I'm way up there in that Vermont area. That land that's not really, doesn't really exist. Alright, so the other option is to do this differently. <laughs> so glue. Cheese and corn. Just cheese and corn. No, 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 don't go, don't go all the way over. Oh no, and now it's caught behind another thing. Let's see what happens if I do this. Whoa. Alright, whatever. Uh, I think I'm going to come back for that one. Because I'm low on fuel, so I need to just go and deliver this or get more fuel and then come back. That's probably what I should have done from the beginning is just... Okay, so go right is just um, use a different use just use two trucks to get them. And I probably should have just done that with the Freightliner having it right there, but I didn't have enough fuel. So we got we got neighbors neighbors over here. 
and raised so you got raised in Iowa dad is from Wisconsin so you are the glue <laughs> yeah you that's official I'm I'm the outlier way out here tough and then tough is sort of somewhere around you know in the Colorado area so I guess that's I guess that's sort of similar I don't know how is that that's not the glue that's like the that's like the peanut butter we're gonna have peanut butter in this in this thing too You're not the glue. <laughs> Look at that. We are beat. We're beached. No, we're not. We're making it. Come on now. Twitch from this side. There we go. Get it. Colorado. We got we got people from all over the United States and and throughout the world too, just not not in right at this moment. Oh, this is gonna get crazy! What? It's a good thing I don't have the. Oh boy. So no walleye. Why? Huh? I'm getting hung up on those rocks, I think. Alright, let's try something else. I don't think I'm going to be able to finish this. Is walleye, is that fish? Isn't walleye fish? <laughs> okay, I was right. Glad I was right on that one. So what exactly is it the bumper? It must be the bumper that's getting hung up. That's it. Wow, this thing's beat. This thing is beat. Steak of the lakes. Yeah, I, I, I try. Fishing is really tough. I end up just talking and scaring all the fish away. There we go. Just need a little bit, little bit of oomph. Oh, let me pack the cargo. This, I'm glad I don't have the trailer anymore because this would have been very difficult. <gasps> this is so crazy. There we go. We got through that part. What about here? Jeez, I'm the Tega. Jeez. Oh, we are sandwiched pretty good now. Speaking of sandwiches and steaks. Come on, Tega. You got this. And not that one. <laughs> Guess this was a bad idea, don't you think, Howler? Sixteen liters of fuel left. This isn't gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, no, that's fine. This is uh, this is wedged in there. Maybe we'll just go up this way and back up. <laughs> yeah, 
Here we go. Here we go. Okay, I got it. Oh no, we're running out of fuel. Darn it. Alright, we'll just park it. <sighs> this is good TV, but bad idea. What are you talking about? What do you mean? Oh, that's not the trick I meant. What are you even talking about? Alright, so let's go back. Oh, this is going to roll. Ooh. Yeah, you got to wait for a good one there. There, Char. Try, try Stetcher. Dun, 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 What are you talking about? That's right. I'm walking over here. I should get my uh, my skinny out and my New York sweatshirt on. I know everybody's gonna turn off, but I'm originally a New Yorker. I know, I know, I know, I know. Believe me, I hear you. And you know what else? It doesn't get better when I move the first time. The second time, I, I fixed it by moving to Vermont, though. No worries. But my accent. What are you talking? No. <laughs> uh, yes. Yes, I did not get it. And it wasn't that part of New York. We were upstate. We were very, very, very much the upstate New York area. And uh, so, yeah. We moved. I was six when we moved. I was six. 90, 96. 95, 96 time frame. I guess I was five. I was five when we moved. It was because there was a fire. What does my accent sound like, too? Like, when I'm just talking normally. What does it sound like? New England? Just standard New England. So young. I know, I know. I'm just a baby. Syracuse. Syracuse. I was born in... I was born in Syracuse. <laughs> they thought my mom was having twins. Nope. Just a... Just a bear. Just a... Just a bear. I am very, yes, I am a 90s baby. I won't tell you when I was born. Yeah. <laughs> New England toured Can Canadian. That's funny because it's true. I, so I, the place, the area that I live in Vermont is this, you know, is a, well, it's near Canada. It's real, it's really close to Canada. There's a lot of Canadian influence where I live. And, and the way that people talk up here is very much like, hey, how you doing, bud? Kind of, how you doing? No, that's not, that's not at all. I can't do it on command. I can do it when I'm just sporadically. No, that's not the right word. <laughs> yeah. I won't tell you the specifics. But if you do the math, you may figure it out spontaneously. Yes, exactly. Improvise. Like. And like Bud, like that's something I never you would ever have said. Lee, holy goodness! Everybody, stop everything! Stop everything! It's it's. Hang on, hold up, hold up. Everyone, Lee has joined the party. We we're talking about we were talking about accents. I'm glad you just joined in because I noticed a lot of you, a lot of the people that I've met through here in, from the Midwest pronounce Wisconsin, Wisconsin. Like there's an E instead of an I. It's Wis, Wis, Wisconsin, which sounds funny. <laughs> Lee, how you doing? How's things going? Everybody who's chilling here, definitely if you if you appreciate or enjoy what you're seeing here, I guarantee you'll enjoy uh, Lee's stream as well. Lee zero seven five four. Grab, drop him a follow. Man, he and I have been playing SnowRunner, and he's streaming SnowRunner on the days, and and we uh, and I stream at night. You say it like Swiss Chez. Wisconsin. West. Yeah, that's right. Wisconsin. <laughs> and also, I, I, I love accents. Like, so don't think like I'm like paying attention to them to like make fun or anything like that or mock in any way. I think it's amazing. I think dialect is really cool. 
and and you know says a lot of, or can you can kind of tell where somebody's from just based on how they talk and some of the words they use. Like if I go, oh my god, that's so that's wicked. Anybody does anybody here actually say the word wicked? Like if you're just like, oh my god, that tr that car was wicked cool. I think that's my so after New York we moved to Massachusetts and so I have I have but we were still not in the area of Massachusetts where people talk like they're from Rhode Island they've got ideas <laughs> Lee tough I like that little exchange hello <laughs> what was that what was that did I get a follow what happened why don't I see the uh, thing what's going on here Oh, the host. Oh, okay. So that doesn't come up on... Uh, oh, whatever. I'll just use that screen. I don't know what I was using. It. Dude, Lee, thank you for the host. Also, Howler, thank you for translating what the noise was. Because I was like, that didn't come up on, on Stream Manager. <laughs> oh, I should get a thanks command. That's a good idea. Does this even have fuel left in it? Oh good, okay. <laughs> Mistake oh I wish, I wish it was mistakenly under tanks. Cause actually I think I would, it would be, it would be regular, it'd be that. Wait, can you create one? You have access to my Nightbot? Don't I have to give you access to my Nightbot? I mean, I, w I can. I will. I'm not saying I won't. <laughs> Just saying, I don't think I did yet. Tanks. Um... Hmm... Really? Well, that's interesting. I guess I guess if we had a thanks, um, if it was just thanks, I don't know. I was thinking, and now that I think about it more, I was like, hmm. What? Oh, I forgot about that. I'd seen that stuff written in some of the Nightbot stuff, and I'm like, I'm never going to figure out how to use that. <laughs> that's awesome how are you the man you the man i think that automatically gets gets you put into the giveaway actually mods are going to have a separate giveaway cool okay cool cool all right so let's see so for the thanks command so that'll be like for follow no that'll be like so let's have it say um thank you Mother, no. <laughs> um, let's have it say like, "Thanks for hanging out. Appreciate your the bear." No, let's let's think of something bear related. Okay, so, um, like I guess I'm thinking like, would it be a lurk command? I'm tr think how would we respond? So if somebody follows, we respond to a th have a thanks. If somebody hosts, we have a thanks. Uh, if somebody just chills with us, we'll have a thanks. Um, yeah, maybe just make the command, the thanks command, just pretty basic, just simple, like, you know, thanks for spending your time at the bear den. Spend too much time here and you'll become a bear. Be warned. <laughs> I'm trying to think of how to make it bear related. Yeah, I don't know. I guess part of me is like, do we need like a million commands? Should we have a million? I guess probably. Well, because like when somebody hosts, I like the I like the idea of throwing the shout out. Like, so like I'm cool with not having a specific host thanks because when somebody hosts, we'll do a shout out, um, or somebody chills, we'll do the you know somebody, yeah, hosting or rating, we'll do the shout out and then the thanks. That's perfect. <laughs>
<laughs> honestly, how you could probably you know be creative. I, I, honestly, ah, no, 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 not this spot, not this spot. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Hey, we're okay. All right, I will erase that. It didn't happen. No, 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 no. It's not happening again. Hmm. <laughs> This is tricky, everybody. <laughs> uh, all right, so I'm gonna be I'm gonna be Spock the rest of the game. Yeah, that's it. I'm Spock. This is an interesting spot to get stuck. just get wedged back in there no no I'm kind of going over it no 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 no, no. that rock back there that saved me that that rock literally is what saved me just then uh, are we gonna okay and I just need to refuel okay so far so good don't let's not let's not celebrate too quick here Oh, jeez, yeah, I'm not going to be able to remember those. we got to write them. Yeah, let's not create too many too quick. <laughs> until we get, like, a Google Docs set up where, um, yeah, until we get a Google Docs set up where we'll track them all. And I guess if you want, Howler, if you don't mind, just kind of anything that you create today, which I think is just the thanks one, so we can remember that. Um, but if you do, you know, and I, now that I know you can be so creative, or, like, you can just create them like that, definitely go nuts in a way after which line making me giggle. Oh, so they oh, so they add there. Right, 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 right. So we can it's not about remembering them. It's uh, about remembering to to use them. <laughs> yeah, tough. That was pretty yeah, that was uh that was intense. Oh, that almost made me roll again. That was intense. I'm glad you got a chuckle out of that one. It's 9.30 already, everybody. Wow. And Total, I, oh, Total went back to bed. I forgot. I got to let him know that for some reason the new sub is not refreshing. It didn't even show up on uh, on the mini feed here. So I'm confused about that. Oh, I got a flat tire. Ah, no worries. That flat tire can just chill. That's fine. We got one spare wheel. <laughs> Let's fix the suspension while we're at it. Oh, we can't. Never mind. Oh, yeah. We can't fix it with the spare wheel. Yeah. Damn, I'm not going to try to do that. Ooh. Oh, it's got plenty of spare wheels. I just found the one on the truck. Okay. Roll with laughter. It would have been funny if I rolled all the way backwards just then and, like, died. Or didn't die, but rolled over. great it's a great game come on now look at this is this not the best game ever look at this i'm looking at the replay right here beautiful even at night that was close Uh, 
It's too bright with the lights on. It's gonna be a dark stream now. <laughs> it's like daytime, it's like way too bright. <laughs> Let's steal some telephone poles. I like it. Um, and and no, we actually there's there are some things that we can kind of take in a way, but not not the uh, telephone poles. They're pretty solid. They end up being like winch points a lot of times. It's a good question though. Definitely. All right, so I got to go past and then to the right and finally. Oh no, do I need to go here? Yeah, I need to get there. So I want to just go straight through. Right on through to the yellow side. Right on through to the yellow side. Yeah. Do, 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 do. So I also thought of a new channel point. I don't think, Howler, I don't think I made it so you can edit channel points. I don't know if that is something that you could ever do or you, that a mod can do. But I got a new idea for a channel point reward thing or berries, which is what they are here in this, in this area. Um, I thought of it as it'd be called the Bach Break. And so like, so the Bach break, there's, there's only a few songs that I know how to play on guitar. One of them actually is Bach's cello suite, or not the whole thing, that'd be, that's a lot. I could, I would, someday maybe I'll try to memorize it, but um, yeah, so Bach's cello suite prelude number one, I can play the first four bars. <laughs> Or is it the first four bars? Or I think it's the first eight eight measures of the song. But yeah, so we're gonna create. I'm gonna create a Bach break, and it's gonna be a certain amount of points, and it'll require me to bring the guitar out and have the guitar ready. So it, it's not like you'd be able to do it in instantly. I'd be playing guitar. We'd have to either the amp would already have to be on and warmed up or something. But yeah, it would be you know like a just a short break where you know a certain amount of channel points and. And then, and so the idea is that I, so I can play it without looking too. So I would be like, 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 <laughs> I guess my inspiration would be, uh, so it's, that's about the best I can do. <laughs> yeah, pretty off key. I, I'm not a singer. I'm a bass player actually <clears throat> and actually today in particular I'm not a singer my, my throat is dry as hell I don't know if that's what that is seems like there's some some lawn mowing going on so maybe uh, hang on no okay I mean, that's all that's all that's a rocks so yeah Not, not a singer. Are we seriously hung up on this little tiny, this little tree? I mean, I get that there's probably also a rock down there. Oh, were you talking about, um, Toph, you said the winch made you laugh. Like that other time where I was just frantically hitting the button? Just, why? Push, 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 frantically trying to find something. <laughs> I didn't even think of that. Bacapella. <laughs> Bacapella, that's hilarious. Oh, geez. We got the clip master over here. Chard, I think Chard wants to get into the, into the giveaway. Type, uh, type exclamation point 200. Ooh, do I, I don't want to go that way. Oh, that's where the truck is, right. Alright, let's... Eesh, yikes. Ay, ay, ay. And by close, we are at uh, 199. I don't have the thing up now. Oh, four winners. I thought I said three. <laughs> four winners. This is not going to end well. Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> oh, 
That's hilarious. <laughs> yeah, I know these <laughs> these drugs are gonna be they're gonna they're gonna be stuck here forever. Instead of driving further, I'm gonna see if I can bring that thing back. He says I'm not great at cropping the clips. I should try to get better at that though. This is good though. It's giving me practice. Yeah, hey man. I mean that's the whole uh, whole idea was that I just wanted to see, you know, what people. What, I just wanted to make some contests and evolve like. Clipping the con the content that we're here we have here, so I appreciate you giving that uh, giving it a try. Well, that guy is wedged in pretty good, and he's out of fuel too. So that's can I refuel him yet? Not yet. Oh wait, hang on. Yeah, I probably can. No, nope, not yet. Not quite close enough. getting wedged in here <laughs> there we go <laughs> the source cannot be the Tega all right so now um, do we switch back to the Tega I think so we just move back like is there a way around this there yeah there must be yeah <laughs> all right all right all right it will be i won't be ridiculous the repair truck i like the repair truck too the azov 5319 yes it's a great truck i think everybody here agrees that the, it's a pretty nice one most of the azovs in the game are um, beast. They're not going to, this isn't going to happen. Oh, hey, there we go. Hey now, hey now, whoa, hey, whoa, hey, whoa now, hey now. We moving any further? Here we go. That's it. Uh, I think I could do a three point turn. Maybe right in here in that tree. I think this repair truck really proves its ability. Uh, a A Z O V. Very close. Let's try the same thing. We'll Oh, perfect. We got distance for it. <laughs> With the crane, maybe. Oh, am I getting hung up right there? may not be getting out oh hang on let me see if I can find something sort of yeah let me try maybe that no that's not doing anything is there anything high up that I can winch to back that ass off <laughs> <laughs> Back that is off up. Huh. 
I don't think I have. I don't. I think this is the highest lift. I don't think there is a higher lift. Yeah. Hey, whoa, what's going on here? Hang on. <laughs> Dang, I wish I had the front shot of how high up that was. <laughs> There's another clip. Charred, you're the clip master. We're going to start calling you clip, clip veg instead. Oh, let's not go over those big old rocks. And in fact, let's just turn off here to the right. That's enough for the, the other Tega to get through. Oh my god. This is... Oh my god, what is happening? What? This is not going to work. Should I just keep going? Should I try to do this again? Yeah, let me try it again. No, nope, we got to go for it, I think. Let's try and get this side up before we do that. Yeah, not that that's not what I meant. No, nope, that's not what I meant either. <laughs> All right, I didn't think it was going to work exactly. There we go. That's perfect. Oh, that was perfect. No, that's not happening. You're not rolling over. What are you doing here? <laughs> this is not going to end well. Not out yet. <laughs> Doom Patrol. Doom Patrol. What's Doom Patrol? I know what Paw Patrol is. Is it kind of like that? Let's try it a little differently this time. We got that for stability. Kind of, oh my god. Yep. Yep, that makes sense. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Lee, what did I do? <laughs> Why did I go down here? <laughs> I don't, is this, is this gonna, is this gonna level out? Like, can it, can it at this point level out? Like, it's sideways. <laughs> I'm not sure exactly my best course of action here. Maybe just go for it.
All right, let's try. Yeah, there we go. No, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, there we go. Okay, okay, that's better, that was okay. Whoa, hey, okay, okay, there we go, that's all it was. It's just, you know, need to, need to give it a old retry. <clears throat> okay, okay, so do we get past this part, though? Like, we got hung up on the last one. So there's a winch point. Oh, no, hang on. Yeah, right. Open up the... You know, grease it up a little bit or something. Whoa. Of course, that truck ends up being in the way. All right, let's try it a different place. <laughs> you gotta use what you got. Yeah, that's true. I mean, if all you got is a little, uh, little wheel grease and and that's it, you know what? That wheel grease is gonna go to good use. All right, it's quarter to ten, so that means the the stream is a shorty stream on on weekdays for the bear. And I'm gonna turn Thursdays into Throwback Thursdays. I'm gonna play old Xbox games, or at least the ones that I can get old Xbox one or X the original Xbox and Xbox 360 games and I'm including the Master Chief collection in that so I'll be playing that at some point <laughs> yeah I don't know how how I survived that one that's interesting there's the old near Canadian room <laughs> see I don't even hear it that's just me now I am what I am Old Xbox games, though, yes. Yes, that is going to be Throwback Thursday. No, so the next one will be... Uh, the next Throwback stream will be next Thursday. So I'll be doing those on Thursdays. I didn't do a Throwback today because it's brand new. And I think what I want to do is kind of poll, you know, viewers and see, uh, see what uh, they want to play. But Master Chief Collection is definitely a, uh, like, I, I want to, I do definitely want to play that on here. Oh, yeah, I figured it out. I got GeForce Now going. Not on this, oh, no, yeah, actually, now we are. When we were playing Call of Duty, it didn't make sense. Now it does. This is played, this is a streamed game. Streaming the game to play it and streaming the game to you. <coughs> Mm, I'm so glad that that's not an instant remove cargo because that was not intentional. Okay, so now we got to figure out a different route. So it looks to me like maybe we go back. Yeah. Um, yeah, let's go to the left. Oh yeah, so Lee was doing dishes. Hey, gotta enjoy doing dishes. It's the little things. When you get rich and famous, you take you take those things uh, for granted. I'm I'm that's so hypocritical of me to say though. I hate doing my dishes, but I don't like my kitchen either. First world problems. Got a kitchen that I don't like. Come on, life could be a lot worse. At least I have a kitchen. Why? Why does it always get slow? <laughs> These snow runs, yeah. <laughs> Is that you kind of being like an NPC in the game? Like, wow, look at that. What? This doesn't make any sense. Why is it why is it stuck? Yeah, there was a whole there was a couple minutes in one of my streams where that's sort of what I did. I was like my friend was streaming also, but he was trying to be he was trying to be Conky from Trailer Park Boys, and so I was trying to pretend to be like 
not Conky and be like, I don't, don't want to talk to you, Conky. You're mean. So, yeah, they're, yeah. <laughs> the economy. But it's got electrolytes. Yes, I see what you mean. I'm glad that you clarified what RP meant. I was going to say, you got a... I don't know, I don't, even have a, I don't even have a thing for that. Oh, I see there's a rock right in front of me. Um... Yeah, I like the role play. That's funny. That's kind of fun, just trying to... Like, well, I don't know, Conky. I mean, they're my friends, though. And he was, like, being, like, real creepy. But it'd be funny to play it in-game. Like, get four people to be, like... <laughs> be funny to play, play uh, role play in this game. I'd just be me, except I'd have, like, some weird mission to do or something. Ooh, let's go out and around. Let's take a right, and then after the boulders in the field, I'm going to take another right. So, got to get a truckload of cats just for bubbles. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You know you know those guys, then. Bobbles. Oh, type uh, exclamation point Ricky. Whoever gets it first wins the Ricky prize. Hands down, one of my favorite quotes from the from the show, and one of the few quotes we can I, I can put on here. Dude, sometimes, you know what, ravioli's all you got. And if you got nine of them, sometimes, sometimes you just go through them all. That's life. Hey, Pixel Mullen Gaming, welcome, welcome. How are things going? How's your night? Or morning? Or afternoon? Or middle of the... I don't know if you have a different time zone or time frame. Like if it was like a different planet, I guess it would be like... Uh, I don't know. I can't think. It's too late and I'm tired. <laughs> Oof, sleepy sleeps. Yanni, Yanni the bear. Yawn, yawn. And you're EST. Ah, so yes, it is the same time. 9.50 p.m. Yeah. It's a little late. Oh, I see. Yeah, I started going around this guy. Is this the... This is. Okay, yeah, so I just want to cut across here and get to the path. It's literally right around here. Let's see how deep the snow is. Glad your evening is going well, Pixel. We are here playing SnowRunner for probably another 15 or so minutes. Um, murder more trees. I see. Did I? Oops. These ones I can't murder. They're too strong. Their 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 force strength is much higher than mine. Also, I'm not going to get through there. Looks like there's a spot there, though. Role play snow runner. Dude, let's do it. Lee, we're going to get into a game. We're going to pretend to, like, not know each other. And just, like, we'll just... <laughs> we'll just pick houses in a map. And then, like... Like, we'll, like, get a truck stuck. No, because... See, you need to be able to get out of the truck to be able to be like, Hey, can you help me? I got stuck. And I'll be like... I'll be like, Too bad. Guess you have to go find your own way out. Oh man, this is the this this is not a good. Um, and and Pixel, that's all good. I'm glad you're here. Uh, it's good to see you. I'm glad that you're able to chill for a little bit and 
right before you get to get on to bed. Uh, no trees were harmed in this. That's right. That's right. These are fake trees. They're just going. They're not fake trees, but they're going to sleep. They're fine. They're going to wake up later. They saw me coming. They were like, "Whoa, we better lay down." Oh, I need the bears coming. They're bowing. That's what it is. They're bowing. It's like, whoa, royalty. The one, the only, the bear. I'm Batman. I've been wanting to say that on stream for so long. Lee, I'm Batman. No, I'm Batman. I'm Batman. Batman. Oh, that was a bad idea. Uh-oh. Come on, Tega. You got it. These rocks ain't nothing. Uh, left or right? Left. I think to the right was the watchtower. Oh yeah, I'm getting tired. I can feel it now. I can feel it. Come in the end of the night. Oh yeah. I can feel it coming in the end of time. Night. I don't know. I don't know the lyrics. I'm not a good with lyrics. <laughs> not good with lyrics unless I like memorize it. Awesome. Appreciate you, Pixel. Thank you. Could feel my this this. I think the oh yeah. Look at how bright it is on. Look at that. Being like blinded by the light. Let's set that to. Uh, Let's go, let's go for eye saver. Yeah, that'll that'll feel better. Oh yeah, you guys don't have the. No 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 no. no. <sighs> nice. All right, let's go get the flight star. Freight star, flight flight star. Oh yeah, I didn't I left this without fuel? I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretending that didn't happen. <laughs> I wonder if I can sneak through this way. Let's uh, drop that. I don't need the... I remember that way being a total nightmare. This map is so difficult. Dude, and I don't have a garage. Oh, man. That's what I'm trying to do. The sideways truck? Uh, was that the the one that I just rolled? The, the Tega? Or the uh, Azov? I don't know if I rolled the Azov. This is, this is real. This is simulation right here. It's exactly what would happen. Yep. Yep, that makes sense. <laughs> I know, it looks like I was on way shorter. I played Call of Duty a little bit earlier today with a friend earlier this evening. And and then I had to restart the stream for it to figure itself out, unfortunately. And so, yeah, it's an early one. But tomorrow, man, we'll be, we'll be here, back here. I think same time, 6-ish. Tomorrow I'll probably be on early. <laughs> Nate Bear is sleepy and so will take a nap. <laughs> so take a nap. <laughs> Charred. That's so good. <laughs> oh man. I like read it twice. I had to read it out loud and I was like, yeah, I don't get that at first. That's so good. I'm sleepy and I'll take a nap. <laughs> Oh yeah, so if, I don't know if you guys seen, but somebody press exclamation point two hundred if you want to hear the the challenge, the latest challenge, and the latest way to get into the giveaway. Yeah, we're a hundred. We're a hundred ninety nine viewers. If we break two hundred before the end of the before in the next five minutes. I'll give you a. I'll give you the 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 Bach break. We'll, we'll sh I'll demo the Bach break. 
think the, oh, I turned the amp off. It wouldn't take long to warm up. Oh no, I don't want to go that way. I know, I know, I'm stoked. Um, I haven't exactly decided on the giveaway. It's usually like a game giveaway for giveaway fuel. Yeah, I'm getting fuel right now. Yep, you got it, tough. Yeah, gonna be probably a game. I think since SnowRunner is coming out on Steam, that might be the the way that the, what I do. Oh, did I miss? Did I miss something that LW said? I've got this tiny little chat window that I've been using. Oh, oh, LW asked clipping. Sorry, I didn't see that. Let me switch back over to this one. Um, yeah, clipping. Yeah, it's like little little snippets of what's going on in the in the stream. And what the the really cool thing I think with it is that if you watch the clip after, you know, you watch the thing it'll it picks up right where you left off from the clip in the stream if that makes sense. All right, so now I got to take this guy and go over not too far actually. No, that's the Azov. I got to go here. May 18. Ooh. Uh, so let's go back the way we came. Well, uh, sort of. I'm going to skip over on the right, maybe? Yeah. We don't even have to go through that other stuff. Oh, snap. Yeah, it is cool, too. It, it also works if you, like, think you missed something cool. You can just click that real quick, and then you get, like, the last two minutes of the stream to see if you missed something. Hmm. This is sort of already seeming like a bad idea. Yeah, yeah. It sounds like a good idea to play it on PC, possibly with with co-op oh it's not even they don't even have it in the in the market yet you love those words which words <laughs> oh yes yes <laughs> that's a bad idea oh no kidding it's, it's funny, the night bot, so the timer must have, yeah, it must be like an hour set. That makes sense. And actually, this time, bad idea meant it's probably going to take me a while to get through. It's kind of slow. But yeah, here we are in SnowRunner, everybody. Not playing Call of Duty at this moment. Was that? Oh yes, I was telling somebody about that clip yesterday, the day before. Somebody was at that part and started slipping, and I was like, "Yeah, I did that too." Except I had something on, literally in on the crane. It's such a good, good clip. Nah, I'm gonna kill that other nightbot. That that other reminder seems like it comes up too often. And feels like an ad for Star for GeForce now, which it sort of wasn't supposed to be. It was supposed to just be a reminder or let people know, hey, I'm playing on GeForce now. It exists and it works really well. Input lag is not there. It's not even noticeable if there is one. Atticus, what's up? What's up? What's up? How you doing? How you doing? Look at the crew is assembling. No. Bad. Bad truck. Don't don't tumble. It's not nap time. I did. Yes, I did. I bought it at the right time. I got it at the right time. I was so lucky, man. Holy luck. Because I think it's way more expensive now or something. Bad, bad truck. Yeah. <laughs> 
Yes. 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 I wasn't even planning on getting it, but I have really good internet, and my friend, and I was kind of like, man, I wish I had a new PC, and my friend was like, oh, dude, you have good internet? Like, really good internet? You should check out GeForce Now, and I was like, yeah, I thought about it, but I don't remember how good it is. I heard it was, you know, it's a streaming, you're streaming a game. How good can it be? And, and then it was free, and I was like, oh, all right, all right. Wow, the price is double. Which I'm not sure, I don't think it's, I think still, what is that, like 20 bucks instead of like 11.99 or something? Oh, no kidding. <laughs> and I wonder what the Star Star days were. It must have been, it must have thought that was a link or something. Yeah, I think that's like it's the like the my favorite part not my favorite part, but I love I love that idea though. <laughs> Your phone died. Oh no. I hope it's alive again. You revived it, you used resuscitation or a uh, a green herb. Um, that was a Resident Evil resident uh, reference, not a drug reference. Everybody knows. Um Dude, night's going great, Atticus. Um, I decided there's a new... We're going to have a new challenge. Oh, oh I'm, in, I'm where I need to be. Okay, hang on. Whoop, back up. Beep, boop. Uh, I decided there's going to be a new... Oh, no. <laughs> oh, wait. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Whoa, hang on. We're so okay. We're okay. Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, no. We're beat. That's it. It's all good. None of this winch is going to work. Let's see if I can use the crane real quick. Because everything is starting to... <laughs> we'll yeet ourselves up. Alright everybody, that is one way... Uh, no, it's not one way. Hang on. It's not working yet. That is one way to, to rescue yourselves. I'm kind of proud of that one. <laughs> that was really lucky, though. I need to go very carefully. <laughs> These rocks, man. All right, so let's um, try to wiggle our way in over here, wedge our way in. What? Huh? Let's see, it was hung up on something earlier. Um, oh, Lee, take care, take care. Have a good night. Make some dinner. Enjoy that dinner. All right, let's see what happens if we go to crane mode now. Um, yeah, what other games? Yeah, what other games do people play? <laughs> Wait, a lap full of cat? Leaning, oh, 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 you got a cat in your in your lap. <laughs> Jealous. I think I, I think it is getting close to that time of actually getting it. Oh no no no! Wow, I didn't even see that happening. Uh, let's see. Nope, that's not what I want to do. disaster is my siren song <laughs> yeah no I get that totally get that uh, let's see this might be a bad idea 
No, it wasn't a bad idea. Okay, so now let's see if we can move this guy back. Carefully. And then maybe we can drag it all the way over here. Yeah, there we go. We can probably drag it up here. Question is, will it tip the vehicle no matter what? Uh, not if I keep it close. <laughs> Thought you were chill. Let me, uh, let's at least have morning. There we go. We had a nice rest. Now we'll finish the job. Let's see, what did I miss here? In a pinch, get out of the winch. I like that. That's hilarious. <laughs> get out the winch. P-O-E? What's P-O-E? Uh, let me think. Power? No. P-O-E? Last Epoch quite a bit. That's interesting. Then I play... Oh, well, that didn't help. Path of Exile. Aha! Yeah, I haven't played that one. All right, let's see if we can just uh, put it in the trailer or in the thing anyway. Oh, okay, yeah, that makes sense. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. It's an ARPG assault. Is that an arena? Is that arena? I'm such a noob. Noob Nate. Noob Nate the noob gurger. Right, let's try this again with a different truck. See how it goes. <clears throat> oh, action. Let's not do the same thing. Oh, we're already doing the same thing. But if we go higher up, maybe? And then just go it. Go for it. Oh, never mind. I should have kept going this way. I think it's okay. Let's just go straight over to the ridge. Uh, and, then, and then we've got to go that way, I'm guessing. This looks like a path, right? No, 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 no. No, no, no. There we go. <laughs> Truck highway. For whatever reason, I can't move forward at all. There we go. Okay, so we're almost there. Let's see how close we are. Ooh, we're not close very, but we've got a turn to make, and then we've got some interesting stuff to do after that. Do I have a snorkel on this truck? I do not. Oh, no, I do. I do. Good. All right. Action RPG. Interesting. Interesting. I, I need to learn more about what that is. I've seen Path of Exile like this. I've seen the, um, what's it called? I've seen the ad, or I've seen it on either Steam or GeForce Now. I think it's a free game, maybe? Maybe not. And then, so we got Red Dead. Oh, so Atticus, you like in Village? You like in Village? I'm guessing you played the old ones. I really liked Resident Evil 4. That was a, obviously, that I think might have been a big one for every, a lot of people. <clears throat> and, um... Factorio, interesting. Don't know that one. You fold and rolled enough trucks, eventually you got a truck highway to drive out on. <laughs> yeah, Factorio is another one I haven't heard of.
What is it about? Do you have to build a factory? That's just my guess. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna get this mission done and 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 it. factory automation. I feel like I feel like isn't there another game that's called that? What's the game called that just came out? Isn't it sat Satisfactory? Is that the one that is that what you're talking about? Like the latest evolution of it? <clears throat> okay, so this sort of it doesn't really end over here. It's as sketchy as hell. Low and go, baby. That's cool. I need. I like some of those games. Some of the building games get a little bit, not necessarily for me. I like these. This kind of game. I like. Uh, I like Halo. Obviously, I think I said that earlier. Uh, what's another game I've been playing? Destiny Two is a game I like. Um, been into that a little bit. Um, but I need a crew to play with. You know, I don't want to play these games by myself. Like SnowRunner, I think I can play by myself. But I can as long as I can, <laughs> got you guys to play with. <laughs> um, yeah, Satisfactory is like the 3D Factorio. Oh, interesting. Okay, so they are different. They're not the exact same. Like, they're obviously they're not the exact same, but they weren't like the creator or something. Okay. Very, very interesting. Oh, Malachi, what's up? What's up? How you doing? I'm uh, sorry we get, didn't really get to play Call of Duty. Um, yeah. I guess uh, if if they didn't if those games didn't crash. I'd play it. <laughs> and if you liked Warzone, I think we'd be playing it more. But <clears throat> kind of makes sense that we probably don't. <clears throat> so COD failed too many times, and I was like, I don't want to. I don't want to mess with that anymore. <laughs> and I try. I play, and like I was realizing, like I don't mind those. Like, <laughs> I know, I know. I I was. It wasn't my fault though, man. Those games it kept crashing out. And the last Warzone match I played, I think disconnected too. And, um, and that's the other thing I was realizing is that I really like Warzone. Like, if I'm playing Call of Duty, I want to play Warzone. And I want to be in a squad, and I want to be tactical. And, yeah. Pixel plays Call of Duty. That's cool. That's cool. Warzone is so super fun. I like it. I like the, uh, the strategy involved in it. I remember when I first started playing it, I just was the camper. Say that out loud again. I know. If dude, I was like twice in a row, Malachi and, and our other buddy tried playing and me tried playing a game. We were we got into one, I think like didn't the first one kinda work? Or no, the first one failed, I lagged out. And then the second one didn't load for me. And then I think they backed out and joined me, and then the third one did the same thing. And I was like, well, I'm going to let them play that out, and I'm going to give uh, go play Warzone and see if it has the same problems. And it didn't at first, and then it did. <laughs> Alpha Warzone? <laughs> did I say something? <laughs> we had one match. I don't think I was in like yeah we had one you're right yeah the one but man I didn't I don't I had like one we had one solid match we sometimes we gotta spend like uh, more time playing out playing out Call of Duty plus plus if I get it on PC I'm guessing obviously it runs better on PC it's probably not the game as more of it's probably the Xbox. Because the Xbox One is not good. Yeah, yeah, you're right. I remember that. We had two matches that worked. But out of, out of like, five, four or five? Yeah, neither were great matches. Well, that's the other thing is, like, if I play Call of Duty, I want to be, I do want to be, like, communicating with the team and, like, squad. And, like, we were doing that. 
Um, but yeah, that's I think that's another again a bit again a big difference in oh that's what I was gonna do. I'm gonna try to go up there. I think a big difference. Oh, it's ice. Oh, you're kidding. Uh, let's try it anyway. Poor B. <laughs> hey, they asked for it. Didn't you see him? They said, hey, screw you. And I said, that's rude. Time to take you out. All right, let's see if this truck can make it up this icy hill. Very unlikely. But possibly epic. This is the little truck that could. Or oh, the little truck that could not. Let's see what truck we got close by. All right. <clears throat> We're back into it. We got that one on its side. Oh, no. This one's not on its side. All right. So we need to maybe find a shortcut up here. See if we can go straight up a cliff. <laughs> yeah. Truck is sleepy. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Just took a nappy nap. Um, <laughs> I like that pixel. Well, we have a problem. Houston, we have a problem. I like the trees it helped to put to bed. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's right. It was just going to take a little nappy nap. Looks like the only solution is to uninstall SnowRunner to get that truck unstuck. You're right. You're right, guys. That's it. I gotta. I'm gonna play. I'm just gonna switch to Call of Duty forever. And thank you, thank you, Creed, for the hydrate. I need to refill this and wash this cup, but. Good. Okay. Um, 15 more minutes. We gotta, we gotta try to finish this out. It's a good thing I don't have to work right away tomorrow, which I just remembered, which is awesome. So we can go a little bit longer. I forgot. I don't have, a, I don't have anything until 10. And I'm all caught up. Sorry, I'm all caught up. I have literally... There's actually... It's not that there's no work, but any major responsibility is all taken care of. I don't have to worry about... All major? Yeah. Major, all of them. Done. Paperwork, done. Uh, thingies that we have to do that mark our time, done. Other thingies, done. Alright, alright. That's silly. What am I doing? I'm not going through here. This is ridiculous. Let's go the long way. As somebody said in the last stream, it may have been Creed, I forget. The long way is usually the short way in SnowRunner. No, 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 no. That's not happening. Let's, let's take a longer-ish way. This drives me nuts. All caught up. <laughs> All caught up, ready to go. Oh, we got to stretch. All right, everybody. And so also, just so everybody knows, any of these channel points, that applies to everybody, not just me. And that means everybody needs to hydrate and everybody needs to stretch. Oh, oh thank you. Maybe we can make it through there, though. I know. Oh man, it's gonna be epic. And it not be it's actually gonna be steam, but it's gonna be epic. Yes. Yes, indeed. Indeed. We usually drink water on this stream too. <laughs> and if you are curious, that's Oh, let's get some fuel. Yeah, that's why we're not moving.
Jeez, I'm running low on that fuel. <gasps> no! <laughs> oh my god, I'm so close. switch for oh right right you'll get it on switch i forgot about that yes no more sleep <laughs> i'm just like no no bad bad truck don't do that well we also like proper or or healthy sleep hygiene in this channel as well not just not just drinking water this is a game that would that totally, you know, yeah, totally is addicting, 100%. No question about that, for me. Oh, show. Usually we say for sure, but for show, for show came out, and that's okay. I'm okay with it. Oh, that's not clear either. That's not going to work. <laughs> that's exactly it. You must... Not every day, because then that's that's wasting water, and that's not okay either. Got to think of the environment. Not every day, unless you have, like, no water washing and materials, which I don't think exists, and, probably, and I hope doesn't. It sounds gross. Um... Let's just sneak through here. No, but you do have to wash them. You at least have to wash them. The sheets must be washed. And I'm still being, I'm being a little, oh no, I did, I got new sheets and washed my old ones. Never mind, I'm not being hypocritical. There we go, we made it. The shortcut worked. The long cut worked. Faux show. <laughs> Tough, you like that one? We're getting that for show. That's a, um, so, do you remember the movie... What was the movie? Yikes. Sketchy. Um, why am I forgetting the movie with... It was an early Michael Sarah, Jonah Hill, McLovin. Um, what was the movie? It was... Uh, and I wasn't Judd Apatow. It was actually a Seth Rogen, Evan Goldberg film before they were real big. And it has Seth Rogen and Bill Hader playing police. What was that movie called? Super bad. Jared, you got it. Yes. Yes. Getting it for show. <laughs> McLovin. Is this even the right way I gotta go? Yeah, kinda. Yeah, it is. It's the only way. This is the way. So Creed is also one of those people that waited waited the last year. So I too will be playing Stronger for the first time in five days. Oh, LW, welcome. I'm also curious about the graphics difference. Um, I'm very curious to see if the Switch has to downgrade it much or if they're able to do, especially the, uh, the terrain. You know, the terrain response is really the main thing. <laughs> the Malachi's like, duh. I know, I couldn't think of it. I was going to say, that, that movie came out... Somebody double-check me. I believe that movie came out in 2009 or 2008, perhaps. Maybe 2007. It may have been as early as 2007, actually. Don't roll, 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 no, I'm kidding. That's a great movie. <laughs> this Super Bad did not come out in '98. I'm not that old. <laughs> mm, Bill Hader was a cop. He was the other cop. It was Seth Rogen and Bill. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, not a f yeah, I'm not huge into Epic either, but uh, yeah, they you know, they want to produce this game and decide when it goes to other platforms. I guess what am I supposed to do about that? Different guy. Oh yeah, no, I know my Bill Hader cast. Trust me on that one. Uh, okay, yeah, so I'll just go through here. I know my Bill Hader. <laughs> oh yeah, I know. I don't know why I said producers. <laughs> They're the peddler. <laughs> I need to see it too. I didn't see it. I I'm not a yeah. I it sounds funny. I've seen interviews of him talking about his character in it, and it looks real funny. I can't believe they said that. Saber and Focus are are gonna be pissed. Nate, we trusted you. You were gonna be our spokesman, spokesperson. And yet, you were supposed to bring balance to the force, not destroy it. Yeah, I watched it too. It's just, I don't like, I hate scary movies, man. I'm The only way I watch a scary movie is with friends and we're making fun of it the entire time. Because, like, they're stupid. Like, I really, they really need to make a movie, like, the Black Rifle Coffee Company guys have talked about it. And they have, like, a ton of, like, like, some of their, some of their videos are, like, if military, if veterans were in horror films. And I'm like, dude, like, that's, and it's not just veterans, but, like, people aren't that dumb don't go in you know like don't split up when there's some murderer trying to murder everybody if people are disappearing get defenses and like hunker down I don't get what that means oh not scary oh that's fine well that's good but still creepy cause he's creepy it's a clown with scariness. Chaos is the only balance. <laughs> what was it? Uh, pa, 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 pa. Parabellum. Um, through... What? To ha uh, yeah, I forget what it is. Cabin in the Woods? I don't think I saw that one either. Yeah, there's scary, scary movies. So one I saw recent, not recently, but in the last few years. Yes, Tucker and Ted, dude, it's so funny. LW, I was literally about to say, the last hilarious kind of scary movie I saw was, was Tucker and Dale, Dale vs. Evil. I loved it because it was just like <laughs> that scene. Why are they coming over here and killing themselves on our property? <laughs> And gruesome though, like that's the thing. Like I think it could have been funny without the real graphicness. Yeah, that's me, man. Also, Malachi, I don't, I don't like, I don't like their description because then that, that implies the movies that I, oh, I'm going the wrong way, everybody. It implies movies that I like. Never mind. I'm not going to continue that one. Yeah, I'm not scared by clowns. I'm scared by creepy things that are trying to attack or, like, harm. So, like, anything that's going to make me feel like that, I don't want to be around. And, like, I don't... There's plenty of stuff in this world that makes me uncomfortable and terrified and scared. Do not need to make... I do not need to see it on film. So, my theory here... Oh, actually, it doesn't matter. I just need to get this thing righted. So, what do you... I don't like the way that you're... That, the way... I don't really like that swear word either. The way that it's described. Like, that... I don't get... Like, I get what you're saying. Like, well, let's... You know, is it... So, just describe it better. Like, instead of that... Instead of bitch made... Is it, does, you mean, like, not scary? Like, scary movies that aren't really that scary? Like, PG scary movies? <laughs> And don't give me my, don't give me the, oh my god, Nate, spiel or look or emote. Because you know damn well. You know damn well. Suffering, succotash. 
Yes, I do not like jump scares, but I love dread scary movies. I think I know what you mean, and I think um, that's something that I dig. Because it's like, if it's kind of like foreboding and terrifying, I'm okay with it. But if it's just like jump, trying to get me to jump all the time, no way. I think some good. Children, hordes of children with music instruments. <laughs> that sounds terrible. Terrifying and terrible. Oh, that's not going to work. <laughs> At least I know enough to know that that's the sarcasm sarcasm thing. I know, it's 10.33. I know, we're so close here. But I realize, I forgot that I don't have to get up super, I don't have to get very early. Hereditary? Alright. Got some movie references tonight. Come on. Come on, yes. Yeah, I was going to say, like, I, and I kind of like, I'd rather get into like a psychological drama or psychological thriller or... Or sci-fi thriller. You know what's funny? I'm going to throw out a film that I think probably gets a lot of hate. Um, I just have to remember what it's called. Dude, I, this is so weird. That's, that definitely is why... It definitely points out how tired I am. Because I normally have all the movies memorized. All of them. Every single one. Uh, let's see. Hang on. Let me see. Genuine, Lurky AF, Jump Scares and Movies. I agree, they have their places. I don't like them. I get them. Yeah. I, like, I have the jump scare, like opening a door and somebody's on the other side I'm not expecting. I get a jump from that, so I'm good. The less jump scares in my life, the better. Hereditary was the one that made you have to pause and take a break. The suspense had me so uncomfortable. Ooh, challenge accepted. I'll watch it all the way through without stop. Attack of Killer Gremlins. Gremlins was a great one, Chard. I watched that one. Don't watch very much movies or TV. Always entertain with hobbies and, and stuff in real life, dude. Appreciate it. Here's Johnny. I. There's no trailer. What? That's bullshit. <laughs> Yeah, in the right mood. Yeah, in the mood to be, like, terrified or whatever. Hey, Blue Collar Ginger! Dude, thanks for the follow. I think I tuned into your stream the other... I don't know if I said anything, but I was lurking in your stream. You also bring us to 200 followers, which, which anybody in chat, please do an exclamation 200. Just so that Blue Collar uh, Ginger, and I spelled it right, knows... Um, knows what we're doing. Clip away. Clip away. All right, Howler. Take care. Take care. Take care. You gotta be up early. All right, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Take care. Thank you for hanging out. We gotta talk about how you know you keep you keep being a great mod like you are, and hey, we get some. We get the bear. The bear always pays his debts. Let's put it that way. Creed with the bear emotes. Yeah, I didn't watch Midsummer either. It looked weird. Alright, so this is... I know this looks weird what I'm doing, but I'm going to get this truck as a... the first truck up. Just in case I need some help up there. Don't worry, Haller. It's okay. I don't care if you don't need anything. That's... It's not about debts. It's about... Um... I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll figure something out. Don't worry about it, though. What about this? Is that the, uh, meh, meh, that, that droid? The one that goes, meh. <laughs> Ooh, this is tough to get up. Hey, tough ball. There are plenty of winch spots, so let's just get this truck all the way up there. 
And honestly, I completely forget if this is even where I need to go. Oh, I see. There's a there's an old path here. All right, let's um. Let's put it in neutral. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, the walking, donk, 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 donk. How was my how was my impression of um, of a walking battery pack? All right, let's see how this does. It's got no chain tires. This is sheer ice. This is literally a river that froze, and yet we may yeah no it's 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 not gonna go up there. It does have a great winch though. Look at that distance for the winch. No way. <laughs> you clip the motto of House Bear. Bonk. 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 Oh, why didn't I call it House Bear Rathion? <laughs> A bear always pays its debts. House Bear Rathion. There's another show that I didn't watch. I watched up till season four. And I do not like watching people tortured. And I said, that's it. I'm, not, I'm done with that show. Never going to come back to it. I wasn't even actually seeing the torture scene, actually. It was actually the, uh, the girl getting eaten alive. Nope. Nope. I'm not going to listen to that. Horrible. Game of Thrones. Hard. Don't be so hard on yourself. Say that too much, you might start believing it. All right, let's just park this old, this old bastard over here. O D B. Nope, that part wasn't a big deal. No, no, him him getting his manhood, that wasn't actually the problem. It was the it was the girls that had that ended up getting eaten eaten alive by the dogs. That's the moment when I turned it off and decided I'd never come back to it. Do I need to go over the rocks? I feel like there should be a path here. I haven't seen True Detective. I may have to try that out. Is it old timey? I'm not, and I'm not super into um, police dramas. Also, I'm realizing that that, in fact, is not a path. But this looks clear enough. I think it'll work. Yeah, I do. It was in season four. I distinctly remember it. It was like one of the beginning episodes of it, too, I think. too late. It's a little uneven. Creed. Let's go to Ireland. I don't know why uneven made me think. Maybe it's because Creed reminds me of Ireland or something. I've got a Twitter that I hardly use. No, I use it. I just forgot to use it today. I think I think Streamlabs will do some automatic ones, but you know, what else? What else? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Creed. Creed kind of reminds me of Oh, I don't know, and I don't know. It was just random. Accents come out of me. That's random. Oh, interesting. Kind of like how it was that Black Mirror was kind of like that. Although it was each episode, not each season. Also, Black Mirror is another show I'm never going to ever watch again. I watched one episode, and my friends were like, oh, yeah, let's watch it. And I'm like, okay. And I was like, oh, this is kind of interesting. And then I was like, this is the worst thing I've this is the like one of the worst feelings I've ever had I why would I come back to this <laughs> yeah I should I should find out which ones are worth watching because I will never watch god I hate that the, the, the scenery that I saw yeah different theme I do like uh, John I do like what's his name I do like him the guy the guy who plays him the cool guy
Yeah, there's yeah, there's a few things that are just like, mm, nah, not bueno. Yes, yeah, that's exactly it. No thanks. Things I do not want to see played out, portrayed. It's like, uh, like I don't, I it's like things that I probably could read. I can personally be okay with imagining myself. But I do. I don't. I think the just straight up imagery of it is just. I also think that we should. We should probably still have that kind of sensitization to it, to, to that kind of somebody in that kind of pain. We should be like, God, I don't want to see this. We don't have to skip it or stop watching, but we should at least have that reaction. I met a guy. There was a, a real good friend of mine in high school, who at one point, he. He was so he was so put off by violence. There was a fight, and and I and I and he was like he's not in you know he was totally like totally just out like not into it at all, and so I was like okay I took that kind of I respected it. Uh, that's not the right spot. Can I get those back? Oh, it is. It is the right spot. Why do I only have to get... I got medium... I gotta get medium logs here too? Anyway, I had a friend who was really against violence and it really stood out to me and then a while later like I asked him about like movies and stuff he said and, and that went uh, that went as far as like he, he didn't watch certain films because it, or certain shows because it was so uh, violent. And I started thinking about that. And I was like, you know, that's kind of interesting. I kind of respect that. Like, we sort of should be a little bit sensitized to violence. Not everybody. We should have soldiers and people who are can like can just deal with it and, and act. But and I'm not saying that we should just be f frozen when uh, when there's violence or something. But I don't know. On media, man, I don't need it. There's so much violence in this world. Give me something to laugh about, feel hard, feel warm and, and happy about. I'd rather have that. But also, with that being said, we're at the end of the stream today because we, we finished the, that part of the mission. We're not going to go back. We don't have time for that. Um, <laughs> welcome, everybody who's new. Um, there's a few people. Chard, I haven't seen you before in here, so I really appreciate you joining. Um, I hope everybody has a great night. I don't know what's going on tonight for everybody. Um, but let's look at, see who we need to raid. But we got a few minutes. We don't have to rush out. No, sir. We can, we can kind of chill for a little bit. How's, you know, what's going on tomorrow for everybody? Tomorrow's Friday. Chart is just clipping. And I think I missed a little bit. So let's see. Damn, don't remember that. Uh, you can send it here, LW. Why don't you whisper it to me, and I will. I'll take a look at that. Um, or join the Discord and send it that way. Either way. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was. Yeah, I'm not gonna watch. <laughs> and then Netflix. I have a little. Uh, a bow, but not watched it for years. Clipping bears. Clipping bears. Posted on Discord. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Let's see. Anybody have any friends they want me to raid? We got a... I don't know how many people we got. We got nine nine people to raid. Who, who do we got online right now? Oh, it's Friday for you. And the sun is rising. Haha. <laughs> Very good. Oh, Cosmic is playing. You guys want to watch Minecraft? Would you join me for one of our friends? Unless anybody has a friend they want me to raid. Let's go with... Um, yeah, let's go raid. Let's go raid Meaningless. Cosmic. She was super cool. Hanging out with, hanging out with Cosmic the other night. Chard, thank you so much for hanging out. I really appreciate that. Everybody who's been here is new, who hasn't been here, thank you so much. I'm not a. I have. I have a lot of other things that I kind of just spout out about just the channel and things, but tonight's not the night. 
<laughs> I don't have it in my in my memory in my head. Um, thank you so much for everybody hanging out. Um, you know, until next time, I will be back here tomorrow around six. I might try to get on early if I can, uh, and if I can't, I will be on definitely by or around six. Uh, Creed, have a great one. LW, enjoy. Atticus, thank you so much for hanging out. And and everybody, LW, we got uh, looks like this main Malachi. Thank you, and we will get Call of Duty. We will play Call of Duty. We just need to uh, we will spend some time so that I don't feel like I'm kind of rushing and then having games crash. All right, everybody, let's go raid uh, meaningless cosmic. Uh, let me open her stream first. I don't like raiding without having it right there. A little Minecraft action. Alright, everybody. Take care, take care. See you in the next one. Alright, actually, that's not quite yet. I have to... I have to trigger the raid to happen. <laughs> I love it. Is that a Nick Cage emote? Oh my god, I need to have that. Hey, can Nick air. Alright. Alright, everybody. I'll see you in the next one.